Kojo Pankrumah is Information Minister and Member of Parliament for Fosia Yebe Consuensi. He joins us from the Jubilee House. You see him right there. I thank you very much, Mr. Pankrumah, for a time this evening. I mean, now we have an update of the case 205 now. We have recoveries full and those who are recovering. And now we have six regions recording cases out of the 16. How good or bad can it get? I mean, do we have an idea in the coming days and months? How many positive cases have we found? In fact, we like the fact that we are aggressive in looking for um, cases. We're going after the virus. And the more we go after the virus, that means the more we do the aggressive tracing and testing, the more numbers we will find. So good or bad is not about the numbers we find. Good or bad is really about the status of the positive cases. As at, uh, I think earlier this morning, there were only two that were critical and the rest were all either responding to treatment, uh, about 49 of them had been discharged at home and were completing their treatment. About three of them had uh, tested negative after the treatment. So good lies in the status of the positive cases as we have them now and the fact that we're able to aggressively go after the virus through this enhanced tracing and testing uh, mechanism. Because if you don't do that, then you'll be living in uh, ignorant bliss. Absolutely. And not knowing what is going on. Uh, yes, and obviously that's what the WHO has been advising. Testing, testing, testing. Are we testing enough? I mean, uh, from what we're doing right now? I always say enough is relative. Depending on your case, you may decide to do a particular testing uh, approach. In our instance, the majority of our cases in the general surveillance until recently were cases that have been brought into the Ghanaian jurisdiction by persons who are traveled in. What we have decided to do is to have a clear list of about the first 1,000 contacts of these positive cases initially, about some other 5,000 persons on 28 flights that fell within the category of um, aircrafts that came in from countries that had recorded cases at the time. Now, if what we are doing is aggressively searching for these about 6,000 persons and uh, testing them and also uh, testing persons in neighborhoods that are close to them, for our purposes, it suffices for now. If we have reason to further enhance that test, then we would have to find other ways of scaling it up. But for now, looking at a target of about 50,000 tests that we want to run and using these parameters, we have a considered opinion that we're in a good space. Um, I want to find out what exactly informed that decision to have just 50,000 and then also whether we have enough test kits because the president mentions some 50,000 test kits. Do we have all of them? This morning, the Ghana Health Service in Well, we apologize for this, but Kujo Pankrumai is Information Minister, uh, just reaching us on Skype uh, from the Jubilee House. Uh, we understand there's a crucial meeting going on right now, and uh, that's what you see right there. We'll try to reconnect with him and get an update on this. Well, as he stated, we have a number of about 50,000 uh, that the testing is going on, and uh, wanted to find out from him if we have enough test kits and whether or not these tests would actually come to the 50,000 and what exactly informed our decision to go into the 50,000? I'm sorry we've got raised back on, on Skype again and get some more details on this. But 